Hello, my friends. Today I'm gonna make dinner. I'm making dinner off the cuff. If you're new to my channel, I'm a trainer, a nutritionist, and a coach helping you in mind, body, spirit practices. But tonight, this evening, I'm just your host. I'm your humble host. You come into my house and we're gonna cook some dinner together. Let's you and I figure something out. This is not planned, but this, this still, I wanted this to demonstrate and show just some, some basic cooking stuff. I was like, you know, I'm gonna cook dinner. What do I have got? I've got Bear Monday. I've got some Brussels sprouts and you're gonna have to stay tuned for the third side because I don't know what it's gonna be yet. I'm not sure. <laughs> Cause this is just like a normal day where sometimes I'm not exactly sure. I don't have the whole thing planned out, but we're gonna figure this out together. So I love Bear Monday. This Bear Monday is something that you can get at the frozen section of most health food stores, especially Whole Foods. I know every Whole Foods has this. Sometimes HEB carries this. If you cannot find Bear Monday, cod is an equal kind of flavor profile. They're both very light, very buttery, very neutral, and so flaky and so yummy. I love the Bear Monday though, because I love having frozen, this is always in my freezer. I always have a pack of this stuff in my freezer because like I said, it's so delicious, so buttery, so light, so yummy, so good. You and I together, we're gonna do this together. Are you ready? Let's get started. Let's make a start. So we've got the Bear Monday and this has been thawed out in my fridge and maybe use kitchen scissors, by the way, side note. And I'm gonna spray these babies down with spray olive oil and make sure when you get your olive oil or any spray oil that there's no propellants or soy lecithin in the in the ingredients those can be irritating and not great for your system i'm just going to spray both sides down with a little oil i'm going to use redmond's salt nothing in this video is sponsored like i said unless it's sponsored by brendaturner.com <laughs> so anyway we're going to sprinkle we're going to take our hands and keep our hands kind of high above the fish this is a little trick because when you're salting your food and you're doing it really close, you're only getting concentrated little patches of salt on the, on the meat or whatever you're salting. But if you come up high and you do a nice, generous, you know, salting from above, then it's like a nice shower, a nice even shower of salt. Garlic powder. And again, same thing. You go from up high. Italian seasoning. They actually stopped selling the Spare Monday at my HEB near, near my house. And I had, <laughs> when I went to the freezer section and this Bear Monday was not in stock, I had a little, mm, like a heart ache. Oh, let's go ahead and cook these up. I'm sorry about this angle, but I'm, I'm working here. I'm trying to figure it out, okay? I've got some Costa de Oro olive oil. This is actually a nice find. This is a really good quality. I really like it. And the, the price point is awesome, $7, $7.99 for this bottle. And I got a pretty big pan. You're not supposed to crowd your pans. You're not supposed to put a bunch of stuff in your pans at once because then the food doesn't brown as well. If I'm being honest with you, which that's what this relationship is all about, honesty. I'm here to be honest with you. In honesty, I would normally put as many, cram as many pieces of fish in that pan as I possibly could. However, for the sake of this video, I want these to brown up so that, you know, I, I wanna impress you, basically. The Bear Monday doesn't take very long. It's a very delicate fish, and I've got the, the pan on medium-high. And then while that's cooking, I'm gonna get my Brussels sprouts into the steamer pot. Cut the ends off, and I've cut them in half. The Brussels sprouts, we're gonna steam these, and this is actually a recipe that Andrew Weil has. Andrew Weil, the OG, the man, the tea maestro, and also the forever looking like he's 68, but he's actually like 92 or something. He's got this recipe. This is a recipe of his, and it's called Brussels sprouts for people who don't enjoy Brussels sprouts. And I really like it. So I'm gonna show that to you today, how to cook Brussels sprouts for people who don't like Brussels sprouts. The Bear Monday has been flipped, and you'll see it's golden, delicious, beautiful, stunning, gorgeous, perfect, and all the other adjectives that we could use to describe beauty incarnate. Our Brussels sprouts have turned bright green and beautiful. We're gonna put some oil in this pan. We're gonna put them in the pan that's already been heating up. Spray these down with a little bit more olive oil. Season with some more of that Redmond salt. Crushed red pepper would also be great. I've got three cloves of minced garlic in here. 
And now we're gonna saute these Brussels sprouts for a minute to two minutes until they just start to get a little bit browned and start to smell like that garlic. I think the wild card, that big question mark that I wasn't sure about, that third side, I think it's gonna be a salad. So I'm gonna show you a quick little dinner salad that I can throw together. We're gonna make some salad. I've got some, the, the protein greens and I've got celery and um, we're doing a chop and chat. If that's okay with you, we're gonna do a little chop and chat. I'm really excited about my new podcast. So if you haven't checked out the last episode of this on this channel, um, I did post my first ever podcast. Please go check it out. You're gonna love it. Hitting you with a purple carrot and we're gonna do a mandolin today. So make sure you're very, very careful when you're doing a mandolin. Don't do it in a YouTube video where you're making eye contact with the lens. A very bad idea. Not very safe. Cannot advise. That's something only a wild man would do. Wild woman. Someone who isn't stable. No, I'm just kidding. I'm. I'm stable. We got a cucumber. I like to just hit the whole thing with a mandolin a lot of the times, especially if I'm feeling lazy and I don't want to do too much shopping. So I'm going to, same thing, mandolin, slice some cukes in there. We've got some green onions. And look, there's just something inside of me. I'm just, when I make dinner, I, I, I tell myself every time, it's just going to be a simple little thing. Just a simple little thing. You know, you don't have to go all out. You don't have to be a Michelin star chef every time, but I've got these particulars that I really like. I really like the extra special touches. I like to put, you know, lots of different vegetables in my salad. I'm gonna be using some radicchio today. Kind of rip it up, give it a quick rough chop. And then I'm gonna add some radishes. I'm gonna give this a quick shake. All right, guys, so that's my dinner for tonight. I've got the beautiful Bear Mundi, the awesome side salad, and the Brussels sprouts for people who hate Brussels sprouts. And don't forget to join the wait list for the School of Transformation so that you can flourish, so that you can be healthy in body, mind, and spirit. It's gonna help you with your health, your well-being, vibrancy, your energy levels, and so much more. Put the links for everything below. Other than that, I hope you have a beautiful day. Take really good care of yourself and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.